Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new, my name is Bobby. Today we're gonna check out my heritage DNA test. I already assume it's gonna be 100% Balkan, but well, let's see. I'm excited! Yes. That is my excited girlfriend in the background. Yeah, hello guys. Only 68% Balkan? 68%? Okay. <laughs> what? 32% Greek and South Italian. <laughs> Wait a second, I can't hear you. That that's it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, well, that's not too surprising at all. That makes sense. Yeah. A 68% Balkan, and I already expected this. So, as you can see, it doesn't go into further detail. It doesn't say Bosnia, Serbia. It doesn't say Croatia, Macedonia, Bulgaria. or even partially Bulgaria. It doesn't say anything on those lines. So it just generally says 68% Balkan. And here, South Italian, well, I'm not too sure, probably Greek. And as you can see, it's 32%. Well, I can't wait for the comments <laughs> of the Greek viewers telling me that I'm Greek anyway, and there is no such thing as Macedonia, quite hilarious. Although, now thinking about it, there has been a time where Macedonia, especially the city where my family comes from, has been colonized by the Italians. So therefore, who knows? It could really be that I do have a little bit Italian in me as well. That's why you're such a macho. That is why I'm such <laughs> a nice guy, she said. Yes, exactly. Yeah, well, that sums it up. So before I did this test, I wrote down what I thought I'm going to be. And it was 80% Balkan, Turkish, Persian, Greek, Italian. I don't even recollect doing this. And I was hoping to be a little bit Asian because I love Japan. However, then I watched one YouTube video of a Bosnian guy and it just said 100% Balkan. This is when I gave up faith, basically, and I was expecting it to be 100% Balkan as well. It would be nice if we could see which percentage Italian and which percentage Greek. I don't like that they're generalizing that much, but well, it's not as precise as I wish it to be. As I said, I would love it to be broken down so you could see how many percentage Macedonian how many percentage Bosnia and so on and so forth. But well, this will do. All right, guys, and this is it for today. If you enjoyed this quick little video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, please do so. And guys, if you want to support this channel, all the links are in the description box below. If you want raw grass-fed liver, but you cannot stand the taste, Grassland Nutrition has the solution. Grassland Nutrition takes grass-fed organic beef liver raw and freeze-dries it for you. It is a convenient, fantastic way to get the nutrition of liver without the taste. We have Amazon links for you. You can head over there, buy whatever you might want to buy, and it doesn't cost you anything extra. We get a small share. That is a fantastic way to support Bobby's perspective. If you want grass-fed beef delivered to your doorstep, butcher boxes for you. And we have CBD links as well. On top of that, guys, consider supporting Bobby's Perspective through Subscribestar or Patreon. We have a VIP community there where we have Skype group calls every single week where we can discuss any topic, no matter if it is health, lifestyle or nutrition related. On top of that, by joining, you straight away receive your comprehensive nutrition guide. It is an ebook that teaches you the basics of nutrition, but goes beyond as well and is catering to your personal goals, no matter if you're keto, primal, paleo, or even raw. All right, but this is it for today. Thank you very much for your support, guys. And as always, much love and peace.